Hey everybody, it's your girl Nothing for Trouble Talk 20. I'm here today because um, one of my buddies on Twitter, Klee Baby 0711 hey girl, hey, um, sent me a video. She tweeted me a video link that was posted on the Cold Bitchy site and um, asked me for my comment. So I opened up the window um, on to, to post a blog about it on the glimmerance.com, but after watching the video, I felt like I needed to make a video. Um, so I will post the link in the bottom description box and I want you all to pause this video right now and watch the link, watch the video um, on the Cold Bitchy site and then come on back see what I got to say. Bye. So just in case you didn't feel it necessary to watch the video, um, it's a group of young ladies um, dancing to Beyonce single ladies. Now they are clearly um, trained dancers. They're clearly this is a, a clearly a, a professional type of competition for young people. Um, and let me just preface this whole entire video saying that these girls are clearly talented, and um, you know they did their good dancing. But these girls are probably all. I would say between the ages of 7 and 11. Um, and they are wearing next to nothing and getting it like Beyonce gets it in the video. Even more so because Beyonce can't dance like these little girls. But um, it's lots of thrusting and just, you know, get they are getting it. Kicking and splitting and everything else. But they don't have any clothes on, and they are between the ages of 7 and 11. I know, I'm not going to talk about parents. I'm not going to talk about um, artists, because I'm not. you can't blame Beyonce. Beyonce is an artist. She's grown, and it's up to the parents of these children to, you know, monitor what their children watch and how they behave as a result. And I doubt that these young ladies choreograph this very technical dance by themselves, so you can't even really blame them. But I just have a couple of clarifying questions that I'd like to pose. And if anyone would feel like responding, you can go ahead and do that. Um, and, you know, we can get a dialogue going because I'm really struggling with some of the things. These little girls are dancing around to Beyonce and they're dressed up like little harlots. No disrespect, but they're dressed up like little harlots. They have on booty shorts. They have midriffs like straight up tube tops like bong like and they have um what are those things called that you a uh, guard garters and lace and red and hands on hips and everything else and they're seven to ten years old this is not a problem for anybody but me like you can't dress the little girls up like strippers and then we don't understand why the pedophiles are running amok like Somebody sent me another link today for, I mean, I saw this on a blog a while ago, but Abercrombie & Fitch was making thongs for little children. What? Little girls? Panty lines should not be a concern for anyone under the age, I'm going to go ahead and say like 16. Give or take. I mean, I just don't understand what happened to little girls, and it's bothering me. Like, I love, I, I like Beyonce. I think she's a wonderful artist. I think she's a performer, bar none. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, I feel like she puts her back in everything that she does. But she's a grown woman, and I believe that while some most there are quite a few of her styling choices that I am not all the way on board with, you know, I feel like she's a class act. There's a lot of gyrating, there's a lot of onesies, but you know, she's never downright mm, just nasty raunchy with it. Um, but again, she's grown and I just wanna know why like these girls are dancing and we're cheering and yelling and the crowd is going bananas for these girls dancing around in their drawers. And I just don't know, if we've really made it clear to them that we're, you know, giving them, we're big, we're, we're congratulating them on their dancing skills, or are we just clapping 
it, like I don't know like but what is the message they should just be comfortable in front of hundreds and thousands of people in their drawers like no Hannah Montana is running around on stripper poles and making lingerie lines for little little girls what I'm sorry. And let's not forget former Cheetah Girl, Kylie Williams, Promethid. Let's not forget her telling the little girls that um, the sex was spectacular. The random sex was spectacular. And she doesn't remember his name or where he came from, but the sex was spectacular. Mm -hmm. Come on, Disney. Come on, Disney characters. I just feel like... All of a sudden, and I mean, I'm not old. I'm 27 years old. I don't have any children um, yet, but I will. And I just want to know what happened in my very short lifetime where little girls are not little girls anymore. What happened to outfits? You know, when your outfit come on the same hanger. What happened to that stuff that, that they used to sell at the children's place in stride rice shoes? Whatever happened to that stuff? I wore, I wore tights and penny loafers and little cardigan sweaters and I wore um, short sets and I wore skorts and I wore uh, t-shirts. I wore little cute dresses with bows on my butt and I just feel like little girls are not allowed to be little girls anymore. Like I don't, I, I, I just want to know, can somebody just explain to me what happened to bobos and barrettes and baldies? What happened to Oshkosh Bugash overalls and LA gears? What happened to clear nail polish? <laughs> what happened? What happened to little girls?